A young girl saw some construction activity going on outside her village. She became curious and she went to see what was happening there. And she saw the first man who was working there and she asked him, What are you doing? He looked at her with a little bit of anger, exasperation and said, Can't you see what I am doing? I am just laying a brick. And I am going to lay the brick the whole day, the whole week, the whole month. This is my work. Right? This is my job. So what does this convey to you? That when somebody looks at their work as job, they look at it as a means to an end. right? It gets them the money. It gets them to pay the bills. And nothing more than that. So if it is this job or another job, it doesn't matter to the person. Right? Today he is laying a brick. Tomorrow he could be digging a pit. Day after tomorrow he could be assisting a carpenter. No, further down the line he could be doing some other plumbing work. It doesn't matter to him because it's just a job. Right? It's just a means of getting your money for paying your bills. That's how you look at it as a job. This, when you look at something, some work as your job, you're not having commitment more than necessary for it. Right? You're not committed to the work. Right? You're not committed in kind of learning something in that. Your, your commitment to the people around you is also not there. Today you could work for this contractor, tomorrow you could work for another contractor. Today you're working for company X, tomorrow you could work for company Y, it doesn't matter. So there's no commitment to work and there's no commitment to people around you, right? Then this girl went further down into that construction site and she saw another man doing a similar kind of work and she asked him, Uncle, what are you doing? He said, can, can you see what I'm doing? I'm building a wall, he said. And he went on further to tell her, today I'm building a wall. Tomorrow I'm going to learn how to cast the roof and I'm going to be casting the roof. I'm also going to learn how to do the plumbing in these places and electrical work and I'm going to someday be able to complete the whole job by myself. This man was looking at his work as a career. right? When you look at it as a career, you look at that there is an opportunity for growth. It's not just the money that you get from it. You're looking at an opportunity for growth. You're looking at learning new things. You're looking at expanding your horizons. Your increase in money is anyway going to come because you're going to take on greater responsibilities. But essentially, you're looking at a greater commitment from your side. So when you look at something, some work as your career, instead of looking at it as a job, you're looking at putting in a greater amount of commitment to it, right? Commitment to the company, commitment to the work, and you're also committed to the people around you. If you want to grow in a career, you cannot grow unless you help the people who are working under you also grow. That's what... A, good manager does right he grows along with people who are working under him so when you look at work as a career you're looking at can i put more into it right you're looking at a greater commitment to work you're also looking at a greater commitment to the people working under you, you know you're having a greater commitment to your colleagues you want to build a better relationship with them you want to having a greater commitment to the people working under you and you also have a greater commitment to the uh, people above you that's that's the way you look at work as a career. This girl went further into the construction set and she saw another man doing similar work. And she asked him, Uncle, what are you doing? His eyes brightened up and said, You know what I am doing? I am building a temple here. He said, I, 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 I love building places. You know, today I am building a temple. Tomorrow I could be building a home. Day after tomorrow I could be building a prayer hall. Or I could be building a school. You know, I, I built places where people come and enjoy their life. You know, they enjoy learning, they enjoy praying or they enjoy living in such places. I look forward to my work every day and I just imagine, you know, what can I build that people will be happy with. This man was looking at the same work as his calling, right? A calling is something that you get into when, you know, you no longer are worried about the rewards part of it. The rewards will anyway come. Even if the rewards are lesser, still you want to do the work. You know, you want to get up in the morning and run to do the work. What, what is passionate, what you're passionate about. That is a calling, right? A calling is beyond work. It's beyond a career, right? It's something you're passionate about and you don't care about the rewards. Can you imagine that Sachin Tendulkar, you know, in a match, he says, today I'm not going to play well because the man of the match prize is lesser. Impossible, right? He would give his 100% to it. That was his calling. Right? So, can all of us look at work in three different ways? Right? We can look at work as a job, then it's just a means to an end. We can look, look at work as a career, which means you're looking at an opportunities to grow, opportunities to build yourself, opportunities to enrich yourself. Or you can look at something as a calling. And But 
let me also tell you here that not every work can become a calling right some of us may find a calling some of us may not find a calling some of us will find a calling pretty early in life and some also first find a calling pretty much later in life when we have kind of gone through the job and a career and then we look at something you know and say hey this is what i want to do for the rest of my life that is the essential difference between looking at work as a job a career or a calling 